the shit that we're stuck in, we're not allowed to really think about it because we're challenging shit. You're supposed to. The fuck? Like, 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 you know what I mean? The great Muhammad Ali said, if you, if you are still thinking, if at 75, you're still thinking the way that you did at 25, you wasted 50 years of your life. It's real shit, yo. You know, a lot of people that waste a lot of time. A lot of people. They still think the exact same way. You feel me? I don't even think the way that I did three years ago. Just imagine 50 years of shit. Imagine dying thinking how you did when you was 25, yo. <laughs> Think about how much you just wasted of your mind. Mind is a terrible thing to waste. It's terrible. You know? And as long as we continue to, to allow other things, other entities, other beings to have our mind, we ain't gonna fuck away, bro. But yeah, my bad, my bad. But yeah, that's um. But yeah, so it's like if we don't if, if we don't own our minds, if we don't control our own minds, it's like yo, we can't even think outside. Like this is why you get so threatened by new thought. You know, just imagine, just imagine how when you hear some new information, like you, uh, uh that's not real, that's not true. How do you know? How you know? Now granted, this is not to say accept everything you hear. There's a lot of bullshit out there. It's a lot of bullshit about that. But your truth is what has to matter. How that shit makes you a better human being. How that shit makes you a better creator. How that shit brings your divinity out of you. You know what I mean? All of this shit that I just said could be bullshit to you. Literally. However, all of this shit that I just said could be a holy grail for you. But that's on how it internalizes with you. But you have to critically think about this shit. Question it. Test it. Like, you know what I'm saying? One of my biggest things whenever I say something to anybody, my dude, is assume that I'm lying and go fact check me and prove me wrong. That's not, that's, and that's not me speaking from an ego perspective. Like, I know that I'm right. No, no. I, I want to be wrong. I want to learn something new. I want to, 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 to be, to be wrong. I do. I do and I want somebody like if you can bring me back some fucked up information or you bring me back some information that negates what I said we both want we both want and I'm gonna tell you why because I just learned something new and you did some research but if you just accept what I said because it sounds good because you know what I'm saying I speak with conviction and motherfucking and shit just hit you and it's like oh you're in my head X, Y, Z why the fuck am I in your head see that that's I used to hear that all the time you know what I mean? Motherfuckers would be like, oh my gosh, what you're saying is just, it, you're in my head right now. How you doing? Like, that's, that shows power. That shows power. So, it's on me to get out of your head. To teach you how to keep me out of your shit. But see, this is where we're taught. When, we, when somebody has information that we don't have, or somebody presents a perspective that we don't have, we have to follow them. We either have to follow them or just run the other way completely. You know, not challenge it, not test it. And I don't mean just in a rebellious state like, oh, everything. No, test everything and show yourself approved, bro. Period.